Hello, I'm Glitcher Robot and welcome to another Minecraft Let's Play video. Now if you saw the last video you'll know that I uh, tried to build a, uh, a portal in my nether, tried to relocate my nether portal that's in the nether uh, by uh, breaking down the old one and rebuilding it somewhere else. However, that didn't work. Instead, when I came out of my nether portal, uh, instead of coming back to the nether portal that's in my castle, I came out to a nether portal that's somewhere out in the wilderness. The reason I thought it would work is because I'd previously built another nether portal outside of my castle. When I went through the nether portal, it came out at the same place in the nether as the nether portal that's in my castle comes out. So I thought the same would happen the other way around, that building one in the never would come out in the same place in the in the overworld. But but it didn't happen. So anyway, um I've now got to go and find out where it is. I've got myself my bigger map, and I know it's somewhere northeast, so that's somewhere up towards the top corner. That means I need to go past my uh, my village. Uh, so I need to go past Jedville, uh, which is my local village. I'm going to get my sword on because I've just realised it's night time and there may be uh, creepers and other mobs uh, round about. So let's go around here and so if I go up to my village and then just go beyond my village, I know that I'm on the right track. So that's over this way, and uh, I need to keep my eyes open for for creepers and zombies and all kinds of other nasties. I could hear a skeleton there, but I couldn't see one, so I'm not going to worry about that. I've obviously left him behind somewhere. And if I just keep going this way, I just saw a zombie over to one side. And there's... Oh, someone's shooting at me! <laughs> ah! Someone shot me! Well, I'm sorry, I'm on a mission. I can't stop and play with you right now. I'll come back and kill you later. Okay, so it's up around this way, and as you can see, just by following the torches, I'm not really looking at where I'm going, I'm just following the torches, and that takes me straight to my village. Past all these spirit stones on the way. And around here. Okay, and then in a moment I'm going to put my coordinates back up. Um, I know that you can't see the coordinates properly because, um, because I cropped the screen so you can't see the, the, the edges of the window. But um, but you'll be able to see roughly what I'm what I'm doing with them. Okay, and up and over here. Oh, I'm getting tired. Oh, it's because I'm hungry. Oh, it's a very noisy eater on Minecraft, don't you think? Okay. So here we are at my village. So this is Jedville. This is the village that I'm expanding. And um, oh, there's a spider somewhere. Can hear a spider. Can't see him though. Okay, so if I go around this side, and you can see where I've actually started to expand the village, just with very simple dirt houses for now. And and these go off over in this direction here. There's some uh, nice simple dirt houses, but the point is that the villagers will consider them to be a house. So all these houses over here, when the villagers actually find them, the villagers will think of them as actually being a house, and then they'll move into them. And then that way I can get the villagers to move from the other village to repopulate Jedville, which has become unpopulated. Now where's this spider? Come on, spider, stop sneaking around. Yeah, you want to play tigs with me? I'll play tigs with you. Hey! Yeah, I got your string. Okay, so, back around this way, and oh, there's a pig. Uh, I can't get past that house. No, that's something I'm going to have to sort out, because the villagers won't be able to get past either. So let's chop down some of this, and then the villagers can get back. Okay, so I think that's far enough this way for now. If I get my coordinates up, and you can see the top number there is the... Not the very top, but the second set of numbers that's down there. The top one there is 295. I need it to be 299, which is about here. So 299-999. So it's around about here. And then the... Uh, so it rows down, it says minus 53.90664. I need that to be uh, minus 1188.85. So it's somewhere up north this way. <clears throat> so that's simple enough, isn't it? So I know I've gone far enough east, and I just need... To, oh, yeah, I'm going north now. Oh, so that's interesting. It says I'm going north, even though coordinates are right. Oh, no, it's because I'm facing north. <laughs> Yeah, so ignore the north and east, that's just which direction you're facing, see? So we're learning, we're learning together, are we? So that's what these coordinates all mean. Now, okay, so the north and east is the direction that you're actually facing, and the numbers are the position on the map that you are. Hello, cow. So I now need to go up this direction somewhere. It's a shame that you can't actually put markers on the map. That would be quite cool if you could uh, put a marker on the map, saying, yeah, been here, and this is what's there. Uh, oh, oh. Oh, it's, oh, hello, creeper. Oh, two creepers, and I can't back off. Brilliant. Oh, no, I can back off. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, so two creepers blowing up together. Uh, let's, may as well collect this stuff. Where's the other zombie? I can hear a zombie growling somewhere, but I can't, can't see him anywhere. No, no, okay. 
So, okay, back to the coordinates. Um, I've gone a little bit too far east, so I need to come back this way a bit. And, um, yeah, I need to keep going this direction. There's a creeper behind me somewhere blowing up, and there's a spider. Yes, hello, spider. Kill the spider. Yeah, got you, spider. I wonder if anything got dropped. Oh, some saplings. Saplings and wood. I suppose that poor tree, I shouldn't really leave it just like that, should I? Have I got enough wood to rebuild the tree? Get rid of the egg. And, uh, Let's see, have I got enough wood there to rebuild that tree? One, two, and three! And there it goes, rebuilt the tree, good. Ooh! I thought I could hear the never portal then, but no, apparently not. Okay, so, if I head back over this direction a bit, that top number's gone up to 300 and odd again. So, oh, and another creeper. Yes, hello creeper! And hit the creeper and back away, hit the creeper and back away. And don't you dare kill those pretty flowers. Yeah, kill the creeper. Okay, so I'll keep going in this direction and oh, oh, stuck with trees, stuck with trees. Ah, now this looks familiar. Yeah, all of these um, giant jungle trees were uh, were around where the portal came out, so I know I must be on the right track. So here we go, just keep going up this way a bit. Oh, another zombie somewhere. Where are you, zombie? And, ah, a witch, a witch. Oh no, I don't have anything. Ah, a creeper. <laughs> I don't have anything to uh, kill a witch at a distance with. So, um, yeah, witches are a bit of a worry because um, I don't have my bow and arrow with me. You really don't want to get too close to a witch to throw potions at you and kill you. Ah, I can hear her smashing bottles. Run away from the witch, run away from the witch. And there's loads of skeletons over there. And, ah, where's the witch? Oh, kill the witch, kill the witch. Kill the witch, ah, it's lag, 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 ah! <laughs> I fell down miles then. Oh dear. <laughs> oh, and that's why you don't go walking around at night time. Okay, if I, uh, <laughs> if I go back here and if I get one of my swords, I can at least get a sword. And uh, yeah, that'll be good. <laughs> okay, you know what? I, I, um, I think I might actually take my horse. Now, normally I don't take my horse when I'm doing a video because the... Um, for some reason when you take the horse it takes up a lot of memory on the Minecraft uh, program and when um, you also got the screen capture software running at the same time it causes terrible terrible lag but that was quite some distance away and I don't want to lose all my stuff so I might have to try riding my horse so this is my horse my horse and my name is Patch so if you didn't know already my horse's name is Patch now let's go on the horse and um, right yeah oh no it's lagging already see there we go, right, so down here, and uh, yeah, so just like before, I follow the torches and the uh, stones, which are little monuments to the spirits, as per the Spirited Away film, and uh, yeah, oh, I see, I'm storming ahead, actually, yeah, it's a little bit of a lag, but that's not too bad, that's okay, yeah, I can, I can, I can run like this, that's fine, oh, except for going through a tree, okay, and up and over here, see, the problem is I'm going through the woods, so even though it's daytime now, there's probably still going to be some zombies and skeletons and things, um, hiding under the trees, but uh, because I'm on the horse, I'm moving pretty quickly, so it's not too much of a of a worry. But uh, yeah, if I slow down too much, then uh, then I could get killed. And if that witch is still knocking about, then the witch could kill me. Oh, I used to have a sword that was an enchanted sword and it made from set on fire. And why am I stuck here? Oh, I'm stuck in a tree. Doesn't that always happen when you go riding a horse? You get your head stuck in a tree. There we go. Right, so, coming back down here, whoa, a bit super fast there, and round this corner, a bit tricky, All right, there we go. Right, yo, so, I know that it's over this direction here, and up and over, whee! Now then, up and over this one, and this one, and over here. Right, so I know this is the direction I headed in, it doesn't have to be exact. And, oh, no, it's stuck in a tree again. Oh, come on, come on, get out of the tree. For goodness sake, always getting my head stuck in trees. Come on, come on, don't have long, don't have long, gotta get my stuff back. Come on, Patch, you can do this. So, I went over here. And, some mushroom spider. There we go. So we went down here, um, <laughs> somewhere around here. Come, on, Patch, you can do it. You can do it, Patch. 
Come on. Ow. Oh. Well, Patch, I had more faith in you than that. Right, misplaced faith in an animal. Oh, 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 I got stuck. No, here we go. Okay, so. Where do I go after this? Um, it must have been just over the hill here. Uh, was it this hill here? Is this where I got chased? No, I went over the hill, didn't I? I went over the hill, and there were zombies and things over here, and then I went running away from the witch, like a coward. <laughs> and that took me over this direction. Somewhere, somewhere. So I'm just trying to find a path through the trees. That is the uh, the problem with uh, riding horses. See, because it's daytime, the spider can't see me. The spiders can't see in daytime, which is which is handy. Oh, oh, big jump! Ah, there, there we go. There we go. Yep, yep. Okay, and um, you know what? I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I can't get through. I can't get through. Come on, Patch, you can... Oh, come on, you can get through there. Okay, oh, there's one of the zombies. I do like the zombie faces with this texture pack. I think they're great, they've got a lot more... Ca oh, I can see some XP, so that must be where I fell. Yes, and there's all my stuff. And straight away, I'm stuck. Oh, the witch is here, the witch is here! Ah! Ah! <laughs> get off my horse, how dare you! Kill the witch! Kill the witch! And kill the zombie! 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 Kill the zombie! No! Oh no! I killed. Oh dear! I got killed. And my horse is miles away. Oh no! This is terrible. I've lost my horse. I've lost Patch. No! Patch and a diamond armor. You know, I think I would have been quicker going by foot anyway. So if I try again. Okay, I've, uh, I'm going to have to stop recording in a moment, so if I don't do it this time, then um, I'm afraid that's it. No more patch. Oh, no. And I've just run straight past my thing, haven't I? Have I? Where am I? I'm, I'm lost. I'm right outside my own castle and I'm lost. It's because I'm used to seeing my horse there, you see. Okay, come on. Come on. We've got to get those potatoes back. Never mind the horse. I want my potatoes. Here we go, then. Ah, <sighs> This time. This time, or, or I'm never, it's never going to happen. Oh, come on, stop getting stuck on stuff. You can run faster than that, I'm sure. Oh, not without getting your head stuck, you can't. Come on, getting my head stuck, and I'm not even on the horse now. Ah, oh, dear. Oh, it's all going terribly, terribly wrong. All I wanted to do was find my nether portal. I'm sorry if that's getting a little, bit, a little bit distracting, having the coordinates up there in the corner, but it really is useful to me to... Uh, to find my way to the other never portal. Uh, without those coordinates there, I'd just be going round and round in circles. At least I killed the witch. I'm quite happy about that because um, I've not killed a witch without my bow and arrow before. Witches are quite nasty. They keep throwing potions at you that do all kinds of things. Sometimes they kill you straight away, sometimes they just make you a little bit slow. And, um, and when there's other zombies and things around, like just happened there, when you're getting hit by potion after potion and then there's a zombie punching you in the face as well, it gets a bit out of hand rather quickly. Okay, so... Going back up this way. Oh, it's a lot quicker when I was on the horse. Oh, come on. Good grief. Oh, it's really tempting to just cheat and go in creative mode. But so far, um, I've built this world on survival mode. And uh, I haven't got any mods to help me. So, um, yeah, I'm not going to start now just to get my horse back. Although it would be a shame to lose my horse. I really liked my horse. I hope the zombie didn't carry on eating the horse. There's some random XP. Okay, let's go over the houses here. Okay, I've literally got like two minutes to get there and get my stuff back. So uh, <laughs> hopefully I can make it. And hopefully the first thing I pick up will be the sword. And then I can actually hit the zombies and things that might be hanging around. Oh, oh can I get down this way? Oh, it's a bit... Ah, didn't really mean to do that, but never mind. And okay, so it's around the other side of this water. You know, I've never really explored what's on the other side of my village, so it's uh, kind of useful. There's a there's a pig up a tree, uh, cow up a tree. Mm. Happens quite often in Minecraft, cows up trees. I don't really mm. see it that much in real life. I don't know about you. I've seen goats up trees. Goats like to go up trees. Some goats, anyway. 
There's your homework for next time. Go on the internet and find a picture of a goat up a tree. Come on. Okay, so I'm round here. And then just on the other side of this little bit here should be the giant trees. There we are. And yep, there's the water that I crossed. And there's a white sheep and a black sheep, and there's some zombie flesh. Stupid zombies. And uh, let's see, over around here. It must have been so I could actually get through with patch. Um, now where? Now where do I go? Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Don't have a clue where to go now. I didn't really get a good look at where I was. Oh, oh, there's my potatoes, there's my stuff, yes. And there's Patch. There's my horse, yes. Patch. Excellent. So, from Glitchy Robot, I'm afraid I've run out of time there. But I'm going to, uh, I'm going to continue my quest to find the Never Portal and, uh, for the meantime, though, I'm just going to collect up all my stuff that's scattered around the trees. Okay, then. Bye!